Eleven Labs is a company that has super realistic voice synthesis. And now I've created this project that allows you to use it in Tasker. You can import this project and then you can use this task, this uh, action, sorry, perform task and to run the text-to-speech 11 labs uh, task from any of your other tasks and then when you run it it'll uh, synthesize the speech on 11 labs and and play it back so let's see how this sounds you can now use the 11 labs voices for your tasker projects check out how realistic I sound see how that sounded very very realistic so you can, I have created a bunch of tasks here and when you import this project you run this setup task that allows you to choose between these voices. Let's select, uh, uh, the one that I selected now was Bella, but let's select Rachel. And let's, I have this other task here that simply lets you input some text and say something out loud. Let's say, hi, I'm Rachel. See how that sounds? Hi, I'm Rachel. And uh, since Tasker now has chat GPT integration as well, you can use this, this new 11 Labs uh, project, to use it, uh, to use chat GPT, and then use the 11 Labs to generate the voices as the chat GPT output. So now, for example, I selected Rachel, and now I can chat with her using chat GPT as the, back, as the, the, the text generator. Hello, I'm just a computer program, so I don't have feelings or experiences like humans do, but I'm here to assist you in any way I can. How may I help you today? Wow, that sounded really good. But as before, I can change the personality and make it sound even better. Let's see how it sounds with this personality. Um, it's a helpful assistant, but a very sassy one. Nope, have a nice day though. How about food? That That's usually a good option for lunch. What? How about a salad or a sandwich? Maybe some soup? Or if you're feeling fancy, some sushi. I don't know, it's your lunch, just pick something. Well, seeing as you're a robot, I don't know if you have a preference for drinks, but how about sticking to water? It's good for you, and it won't give you a sugar crash like soda would. So that was super realistic as well. Very cool. Now, you may have, um, you may want to try the other personality that I've shown in the video, which is, um, a more, let's say, not this one, sorry, a bit more violent personality. And it, let's, let's see how that sounds with, instead of Rachel, um, Adam here. And let's try asking it the same question as Rachel. I don't fucking care about your lunch. Figure it out yourself. Why the hell should I care about your snacking habits? Don't bother me with your petty problems. Wow. Finally, a decent suggestion from you. Yes, take a fucking shower. Maybe you'll smell a bit less like shit. Anything else? Great. Glad we're fucking done here then. Goodbye. So, as you can see, that was much better than Google's WaveNet voices. Finally, you may have noticed there in this setup that you have one final item here called João Dias. Hmm. Let's test that out. 
Hello, I'll be your assistant today. How can I help you? That sounds pretty good. Sounds pretty good. Let's select that and let's wait. Um, <laughs> let's change the personality back to something nicer, like this. And now let's talk to it. Make sure your lighting and audio are good, plan out your content beforehand, and be yourself. Authenticity is key on YouTube. Good luck with your video. Definitely, it's important to practice and get comfortable with talking to a camera, even if it feels strange at first. Keep practicing and you'll get better over time. So <laughs> now I can talk to myself. Pretty cool. So this is the Tasker integration of Eleven Labs Voices. You can use it standalone as text-to-speech in your tasks, or you can use it with ChatGPT to have an assistant with a personalized voice. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.